Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to round two of trying to film this video. I honestly filmed this video to begin with. The audio was completely terrible, so I'm hoping this time around it is a lot better as we have everything done for a nap, so I'm still trying to drink my coffee, get this all filmed, and hopefully start to edit later today, but we'll see how that all goes. I'm gonna show you guys these basic shirts because I figured that there gotta be other people out there who are just looking for a simple jean and t-shirt combo, but it's not always easy to find a simple tee, or if you do, they're like $30, and to be completely honest, it's, it's just like a plain t-shirt, there's nothing to it really. Why am I spending $30 on a shirt? These shirts are all around 10 to, I think somewhere around $20, so very affordable, so let's just jump right into it and I'm gonna show you guys these basic shirts that I found for the fall. When shopping for these shirts, I had a goal in mind and that was not to pick up any shirts that were black or white because I had recently gone through my closet and I have two bins of clothes out there ready to be donated because they are just old, they are not things I'm wearing anymore. And when I looked through my closet, I really noticed that there was a lot of black and white in there. And I'm just gonna be honest right now, I did pick up one white and black shirt, but it is a different fit than the one I had. But my main goal for this trip was to find shirts that were bright in color, so it would just be an easy combo of jeans and just a bright colored shirt because I have a lot of dark in my wardrobe. Even right now I'm wearing like dark green and I don't know why, maybe I just feel more comfortable in it, but in reality I really do like bright colors, so maybe I just have a harder time shopping for that. So I really try to keep that in mind when shopping, and I think that is an important thing to do for anyone shopping, is to make sure that you have a goal in mind so you're just not buying things to buy things, but you're going out with a purpose. So like my purpose was to find bright colored shirts that are just simple tees that I can throw in with any pair of shorts or jeans. Okay. Now that I got that out of the way, enough babbling, let's jump into these shirts and I'm gonna show you guys what I found at Zara. The first is this shirt and I love the fit of this one because it is a simple V-neck and V-necks, sometimes I have the problem of they go really, really low and I just don't like that because then I have to wear a tank top underneath and it just, I feel like I'm bulging everywhere and it's just not comfortable for me. So I really liked how this one sat on with the V. It was just like enough, it was like high low. I don't know how to describe it, but it was just really comfortable. And it has that loose fit so you can do that easy little tuck with your shirt and you're done. Because I liked this shirt so much and just like the simplicity of it, I ended up actually picking it up in a dark gray. And I know I wasn't gonna pick up dark colors, but I just really like the fit of it. And sometimes you just do need a darker gray. And I just love the fit, like I said, with the tuck. It was just comfortable. So these, are, this is gonna go perfect, I think, with just some lighter colored or another pair of like gray jeans for the fall. Or if you have any pattern type of pants, you want just a simple kind of more neutral color on the top. So that is why I picked this one up as well. Next, continuing with my bright colors, which was my goal. This is, I think, the first shirt that I picked up when I was like shopping around is this pink color and I love it so much. It has this really fun detail on the shoulder. It kind of reminds me of, oh my goodness, I am not gonna remember the name of the animal, but when they have it like all around their neck and they go, hey, okay, I'm gonna put a photo up, but that is what this shirt <laughs> reminds me of. But I just absolutely love the color. It's the high neck, which is perfect when you're carrying around a baby because I'm always bending down, doing things. So if I'm bending over, nothing is being shown. So finding some very simple high neck shirts was very key in my shopping trip. Next up is very similar to the pink one that I just showed you, but is this fun teal blue one. And I love it because once again, it is just simple. It's a loose fit. It can have the little tuck and it just has this really fun pocket on the side with some lace detail and it's awesome and then yeah just loose fit and it's such a fun color i think all these shirts are going to be great for the fall they're just like i said over and over again it's just the fact of having something with jeans you throw a t-shirt on it's no thinking and you still kind of like look like you kind of put yourself together in the day one thing i will say about these shirts is i love them but you can't put these in the dryer because if you do, they are gonna shrink through 100% cotton, which makes them very comfortable, but the dryer is gonna shrink them. So keep that in mind if you are buying any of these shirts. Keeping with the high neck trend is this purple shirt. It's like a lilac and I really, once again, I just love all the different shades of colors that Zara had in their stores right now. And it has this really nice ribbed effect to it. 
And I like this because I bought a lot of looser shirts, but this one is a lot more fitted. So this is great with high-waisted shorts or maybe under a pair of overalls for the fall. So I just like that it can really be tucked in and it stays down too. It's a very slim fit. And once again, like I said, high neck. And I love the longer sleeves. So it's not just like these little like cup, cup ones, but it is a longer sleeve to it. Now, remember when I said I wasn't going to buy black and white and then I showed you that dark gray shirt? I also picked up this one <laughs> because I feel like a simple striped t-shirt is such a good basic to have in your wardrobe. And it's finding one, once again, this is a very loose fit. I have another one that's older. And if you have, I find any shirt that is white, they kind of turn yellow over time because of sweat and everything like that. So having this one was just a new pickup. And I think this one is around $10 as well. And it's just that looser fits. So once again, you can do the French tuck to make tan from Queer Eye. Very happy because we all know he loves his French tuck and I love my French tuck. So that is why we picked up this bad boy. Last but not least, this is not a t-shirt, but this is just something that I found which is such a key basic to have in your wardrobe. And first of all, and well, second of all, first of all, I don't know where you do Second of all, let's say, it is a very hard item to find. So this is a white bodysuit. And why I love this so much, and once again, I know no white, but like I feel like a white and a black bodysuit are two items that you need to always, always have in your wardrobe. They're just... You never know when they're going to come in handy and they're just good to have. And what I loved about this one is because I've tried so many different bodysuits and especially white. This goes for any white t-shirt really. But it has, it's always sheer around the, the chest area and then you can see like your bra through it, you see lines and I'm just not a fan. I don't like that. And this one has so much layering in it. So you have this and then you can see in here there's a double layer around the top so there is nothing being shown through here which I absolutely love and it is such a nice fit that it's just going to work for so many different outfits throughout the fall, the spring, the summer, I think for every season. That was my t-shirt haul for the fall. T-shirt haul for the fall. Oh that kind of like that's a that's a hard like that's a tongue twister <laughs> but that is my fall haul from Zara. I hope you guys liked it. If you guys have any cool places that you know to go to for affordable, just like cheap basics, let me know in the comments below as I'm always curious to know where you guys shop for these type of items. And let me know your favorite shirt or if you have any of these ones at home as well. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to give it, uh, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel as I'm back every week with more videos, usually with Everly, but like I said, she's napping today. But I am working on, I'm going to film next, I have a little haul of baby stuff from Walmart. So if you want to say that, see that, make sure you subscribe because that's going to be coming up as well. So as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye.